Alright, welcome to part 31 of my Midnight Club LA playthrough. So, we're going to go find Annie. And since it's such a long drive, I'm just going to show you a neat little trick here real quick. If you don't, like, if you don't feel like driving all the way across the city, all you got to do is this. Go to race, e race editor, create a race, press the select button to get into this mode. And drag your cursor, whatever thing, to the spot you want to go to. It's still slow, but it's much, much, much faster. And you don't have to take turns. You can just go like right through buildings. So, if you really don't want to take the time to drive, this is a good option. Especially if you've already gotten the 5,000 mile trophy. But other than that, you other said utter huh. other than that you should drive most of the time or you should use this unless you like driving which is kind of the whole point of the game but race me for pinks huh Alright, so here she is. This is Annie at the Georgian Hotel in Santa Monica. Yes, we have. So we went to find Annie, and we ended up getting more from Lester. It's crazy. So racing for pinks. Racing, I should say. So I... this These are risky. These are really risky. Because, as you should know, a pink slip race, it's kind of... Bas you're betting your car, basically. I mean, that's the simplest way to put it. And if you lose, you lose your car. If you win, you get the other person's car. So it can go very well for you if you win. But it can also end very badly. The very first time I ever did a pink slip race on this game, I lost. And you don't want to know how pissed I got. I was literally screaming at the TV. Which is a little bit pathetic, yes. But, I... <laughs> I'm very competitive, and when I lose my competitive edge, my awesome car, I tend to get a little angry. You don't want to see me when I'm angry. So you can't go through there, but that's not where I wanted to go anyway. Damn it! How come I can't run over this thing? Get out of my way, fool! Why'd I say fool? I'm an idiot! I just killed a celebrity. Fuck! Get! Okay, wow, you're just gonna trap me? Thank you. If you think this traffic pisses me off, wait till you'll see the race. I somehow managed to win, but I came dangerously close to losing. I, I seriously thought I was going to lose my car. Because, I mean, mostly because the traffic, the racer himself, is actually really easy, but... <laughs> I was crashing into pretty much every single car. It was pretty bad. Get out my way. And pull in here to the Max Burger. In Old Hollywood. 
So we get the, uh, what do we get? The Firebird, that's it. Yeah. My car's so much better than his. I don't want his anyway. I'll just sell it as soon as I get it. So this race starts off pretty good, but very, very quickly goes south. Starting right there. At this point, I'm like, no shit. Because I... <laughs> You lose your car, you have to either use another one and risk it to both win your car back and the new car that you have to win. I mean, you don't really have to win your car back, but come on. You've got to have a little bit of pride. And, or you have to buy an entire new one, and holy shit. It's, it's bad. It's really bad. Now, I'm not sure, but... I'm wondering if there's a way that you can literally lose, like, the game. Like, if you keep doing pink slip races and you lose and lose all your money, how are you supposed to win? Because, I mean, even in uh, races or whatever that uh, you don't need your car, like deliveries or whatever, time trials, fuck. Oh, Rockstar Barrel. Sweet. There's one if you needed it. So yeah, even in those races, you still have to have a car to be able to drive to those races. So I'm I'm seriously wondering if you can actually like lose, like not be able to beat the game. And if so, what are you supposed to do? So I'm in second right now, so I'm pretty much freaking out. Because if I lose my car, <laughs> I mean, that's a lot down the drain. And I can't really afford to do that in the playthrough, because, I mean, that just takes up more time. And, <sighs> wow. I mean, it's bad enough when you're just playing it for fun. being what did he just lit actually say you're being mean wow what a pussy so there's the finish so all I need to do is not crash if I crash I lose my car if I lose my car then that's a lot of money down the drain but like I can get it back out of the drain. You know, just win my car back, but still. Pink slip one. So what is the car again? Oh yeah, the Firebird. Pontiac Firebird. Chung He. Alright, so let's go to the garage and check it out. See if it's any better than my car, or any other cars for that matter. I don't think so. I think it's the same speed it looks like. No, mine's a little bit slower. Has better acceleration and handling, so... I'm gonna 
gonna take my Camaro, or yeah, Camaro. seeing if I unlocked anything else. Oh, so I guess that concludes part 31. I'll see you next time in part 32. We'll take on more racers and win cars.